Clean first turn, nice snap. Second one saw it. fits in three big moves before thinking about her favorite part of the wave here at the Surf Ranch. She'll get spit out early. You have to rely on your instincts. If it's not gonna be a long, dreamy one, it can change a little bit with some variety on how long that first two will be. So back to business with turn snaps, changing it up with subtle laybacks. Big power hack again for DeFay, putting so much into that. Finds her rail and the wall to stall, getting a good part of the tube. Throws it up through the lip, jams it again on that open face hook, and Joanne DeFay puts together another beautiful ride. Welcome back to the sixth stop on the WSL Championship Tour, the Jeep Surf Ranch Pro. Women's qualifying begins in world number five, Joanne DeFay enters the basin. I think coming into this event, you've got her eye out as a favorite. She dropped some amazing scores in the 2019 event, uh, finishing second place to Lakey Peterson. Joanne DeFay in motion. Big power hack for DeFay. DeFay earns two excellent scores and makes her way to the top of the leaderboard. Oh my gosh, did you see it? She got spit out of that barrel. It's just a moment, like last year I was first for a long time and then I ended up second, so you know, it's just nothing is done. I just hope to be able to show a bit more on the next one. Congratulations to our young surfer from Reunion Island, Joanne yeah. DeFay. Tour veteran Joanne DeFay is the unheralded hero of the Women's Championship Tour. Joanne DeFay is a power surfer that grew up in Reunion Island on the left and then had a beautiful junior career, qualified as a rookie in 2014, won Rookie of the Year, and she's been here to stay. She's won at Uluwatu, Cloud Break, US Open. Tati in the deeper position, but it's DeFay's turn. Driving down the line, setting up a hack. This one opening wide, she's got to run. Lift coming down on her heels. Late hit on the section, she survives. Drawn out car, picks up her rail a bit. It's got a lot of turbulence on the open face. Hunting down a 6.18, here's the wind up. Stretching out that hook, she'll hang on again. And now this inside double up growing, it hammers the finish. Whoa, whoa. Somehow oh. stays on her feet through an absolute roller coaster ride at Uluwatu. Joanne DeFay, it's got to be the most underrated surfer on tour. Sitting in second place, Joanne DeFay is up as the semifinals get underway. There's a connection through the pocket. Hard off the bottom, big hammer for DeFay. Throwing some water once again. There's the lip getting crushed. DeFay in that unstoppable rhythm. Now time to get barreled. DeFay's momentum continues as her first run takes her to the top of the leaderboard. Joanne DeFay versus Carissa Moore, it's classic. You had to think there's an idea that they could have met each other in the final. I mean, Joanne DeFay, runner-up in 2019 to Lakey Peterson. Carissa Moore won the event in 2018. She won the test events before. Chris has proved everything here. And Joanne's kind of that rising star at the Surf Ranch where she gets better every time she shows up. Two women remain. It's time for the final two runs once again. Joanne DeFay preparing for her opening run. Couple of big hooks already, so much power. Almost oh. pulling off a critical turn, but getting stuck. After a small mistake on her first wave, DeFay rebounds with an excellent score on her left and moves into first. Carissa won the right in the first run. Joanne wins the left. The Hawaiian gets the score and moves into first. I started to feel everything at the end there, and I gave it my best. And that forces Joanne DeFay to put on a big performance to try to get it right back. JoJo's been surfing so well, so it'll be hard to beat her. <sighs> the last run of the event is Joanne DeFay. 
Surfer from Reunion Island starts with a power champ. Belts it vertically once again. Battling for the big trophy here at the Surf Ranch. She'll fly through the pit. Kind of a setup carved there. Little whip back into the pocket. There's the coping. She'll just float it. Layback jam just to switch gears a bit. There's the good hack. There's the timing she was hoping for. Setting up the barrel early. Now laying low. Not super deep in the pit, but here comes the finish. Snaps it quickly, then lays it down. Oh. That's been her favorite. Two turn combo out through the barrel snap, and then a front side arc. Wow, what a nail bottom finish. Scores are in for Joanne DeFay. A 7.93, yeah. and she does it. The Jeep Surf Ranch Pro presented by Adobe Champion. Joanne DeFay picking up her first win of the season. Yeah, it's really insane. And I, I, got a, um, I didn't have to get a score on my left, so it was really good too, because <laughs> I had no more legs. I hope I can just stay in the top five and, and make things shake a little bit.